How to fix application made too many requests. Error or error zero by 8086010. When attempting to access applications downloaded from the Microsoft Store, error code zero by 8086010 can occur. The error prevents you from accessing an opening app. A corrupt Microsoft Store cache is the possible cause for the error to occur. For today's video, let us show you troubleshooting solutions that you can do to fix error 0 by 8086010 or application made too many requests error. But before we begin, we would appreciate it if you hit the like and subscribe button for more troubleshooting videos. First solution, run the Windows Store Troubleshooter. Windows Store Troubleshooter is a built-in diagnostic tool that can help in fixing issue with the Microsoft Store app by determining the system for problems and errors to suggest solutions to fix them. To do this, press Windows plus I keys together to open Settings. At Settings Windows, click Update and Security. Click Troubleshoot at left pane. Click Additional Troubleshooters. Scroll down and click Windows Store Apps. Click Run the Troubleshooter tab. A prompt message appears if UAC account has been turned off. You can either enable or skip the step. Windows Store Apps Troubleshooter will now search for problems. If problems are detected, it will show potential fixes. If there are no problems detected, close the troubleshooter window. Check if Windows Store error still occurs. Second solution, verify Microsoft account. If you are using a non-verified Microsoft account, you will not be able to access Microsoft programs. Make sure to check if your Microsoft account has been verified. To do this, press Windows key plus Y on your keyboard. Click Accounts. At left pane, click your info. Click Verify. Verify your phone number by typing the last four digits of your phone number to send code. Input the code to verify your account. Third solution. Delete temporary filed on the data store folder. A corrupt data store folder can also be the culprit for error code message to occur. Delete temporary files stored on data store folder to prevent this. To do this, press Windows key plus E to open File Explorer. Type in the following path to the search bar. Press Control keys, plus A to select all temp files. Right-click on selected files and click Delete from the drop-down menu. Then paste this path again on the search bar to open Software Distribution Downloads folder. Press Control keys, plus A to select all temp files. Right-click on selected files and click Delete from the drop-down menu. Fourth solution, reset Microsoft Store Cache. Another potential cause of the problem could be corrupt Microsoft Store Cache files. Resetting Store Cache delete corrupt temporary data causing errors. To do this, press Windows key plus R keys to open Run Dialog Box. At Run Dialog Box, type wsreset.exe and press Enter. After the process is complete, we recommend attempting to install the necessary updates once more. Fifth solution. Turn off proxy server. Although proxy service provides protection for online privacy, there are instances when it can interfere with programs and application on Microsoft Store. Try to turn off proxy server and then check if the error will be fixed. You can always enable it back anytime. To turn off proxy server, press Windows key plus Y on your keyboard to open settings. Click network and internet. Click proxy at left pane. At right pane, toggle off automatically detect settings if enabled. Then press Windows key plus R on your keyboard to open Run Dialog Box. At Run Dialog Box, type Control Panel and click OK. Click Network and Internet. Click Internet Options. Click Connections tab on Internet Properties window. Click LAN Settings tab. At New Window, make sure the option Use a Proxy Server for your LAN under Proxy Server is unchecked. Sixth Solution Update Windows. An outdated Windows can cause issues and errors on programs. Make sure always update Windows when an update is available. To do this, press Windows key plus Y on your keyboard to open Settings. Click Update and Security. Click Windows Update. Click Check for Updates. If an update is available, click Download and Install to install the available latest update. After update process is complete, restart computer. Once computer completely restarts, check if application made too many requests. Error or error 0 by 8086010 still occurs. I hope this guide has been helpful. 
please support us by clicking like, share, subscribe, and hit the notification bell for more troubleshooting videos.